Hi my sunshine friends, we are back for another activity. So since we've been talking about family, we're going to today talk about who lives in our house. So for this activity, what you need in your papers you picked up, you have this house already made for you with some papers clipped to it. So you'll need this and a glue stick. Go ahead and pause the video if you guys need to go get your house and your glue stick and then come right back. But we'll go ahead and get started. So we know that all families look different. Some people might live with their mom and dad. Some people might live with just their mom or just their dad. Some might even live with their grandparents. And that is all perfect. Like each family looks different just like each person looks different. And so we're going to show our different families on our house here. So if you look at our chart here, we have um, all the different people that might live in your house, even your cat and your dog. And what we're gonna do, you should have a paper for different members of your family. Um, so you have all different colors here. If you have, if you live in your house, you'll put a white square. So I have my white square here and I'm gonna put it in my house. So you just, remember when we use glue, you just use a little bit. You see, that's all I put on my square. And then I'm gonna take it, and I'm gonna put me right in the middle, cause that's where I like, I like to be right in the middle. So there's me on, in my house. Now, if you live with your mommy, you can put a purple square. If your daddy lives in your house, you can put a blue square. If you have a sister or many sisters, you can put more than one pink square. However many sisters you have, that's how many you'll put on your house. If you have a brother, you will do red. If you have more than one brother, you can do more than one red square. If your grandma lives in your house, you'll do a yellow square. If your grandpa lives in your house, you'll do a green square. And if you have a dog or a cat, dogs will be brown squares and cats will be orange squares. So once you get it done, make sure you get a picture with you in your house, uh, the people that live in your house, and send that picture to me and Miss Nicole. We will, we love, love, love to see all your hard work. And we wanna see who lives in your house. Since everybody's house looks different, we want to see what makes you guys special, what makes your family unique. So at my house, it's me and my husband. So we have two people that live in my house. So I would have two squares on mine. Um, if you have four people that live in your house, you'll have four squares. If you have three, if you have seven, however many people live in your house, plus your cats or your dogs, um, that's how many squares I wanna see on your paper. So, have fun with this, guys, and I can't wait to see who lives in your house. Bye!